Type 1 diabetes is something that uh, is not easy. It's extremely complex. It's, uh, it's a disease that, disease that you literally cannot take a day off. Forget about a day off. Let's go a minute off. Everything we do has repercussions. You got to be on top of it. Ultimately, the goal is to try and raise as much money uh, for three things. Um, obviously, the youth, like these two right here, um, accessible to, to technology that obviously isn't covered from whatever, and uh, mental health as well. I got to make sure I'm eating the right amount of carbohydrates. I'm giving myself right, the right amount of insulin. Um, preparing the same way with sleeping, catching up with sleep, supplements, all that stuff. Um, the diseases that I have with not only type 1 diabetes, but celiac, you're, you're forced to do that because you just can't perform if you're cutting corners at all. Obviously, I want to make the NHL for myself and my family. It's my dream, but if I get to that level of performance and get to stand on that stage and, and have that kind of leverage in that voice, I'm going to try and make the most of it with that, and uh, that's what I'm doing with with type 1 diabetes. I think everyone that plays in the NHL or pro, pro, pro athletes across the board, they have the, uh, the ability to do whatever they want with that. They can kind of lay low, which is totally cool. They can be outspoken, again, totally cool, or somewhere in the middle. And uh, I've just chosen to, to make the most of, of, of making a difference in a community that obviously means a lot to me and I can relate to, and that's a type 1 diabetes community. And I want to make a difference in that and, and help these kids out and help their parents out and help their friends out. That's, that's why I'm here.